My name is Ton Yu Tinen. I'm the president of Ho Chi Minh City Peace and Development Foundation. And uh, I'm here at the U U.S. Institute of Peace for the USIP dialogue on uh, war legacies and, and peace. <music> For both sides, uh, finding and paying the last homage to remains of fallen soldiers is uh, very important. And this has been, I think, the main achievement in the process of uh, reconciliation, uh, uh, account identifying accounting for the remains of American soldiers as well as uh, Vietnamese soldiers of the People's Army. I would say the uh, unexploded ordinance uh, issue and most of all the Agent Orange issue, which is a very complex and difficult to tackle issue, which uh, has impacted uh, the environment, but also, uh, unfortunately, many, many uh, people, uh, including civilians. Both sides are working on it uh, effectively, and success has been shown at Da Nang Airport. It's nearly completed uh, at Bien Hoa Airport. But you know, the part regarding uh, the uh, human impact uh, is much more challenging and will require joint efforts for quite some time, I'm afraid. I will single out reconciliation. Uh, we've been, uh, you know, uh, working steadily and successfully between uh, the Vietnamese inside Vietnam and uh, Americans in general. But uh, progress has not been uh, that uh, far and deep with the Vietnamese Americans. So we are starting working on it. Uh, particularly trying to to make the younger generations on both sides meet inside and outside uh, Vietnam and they should meet around uh, concrete uh, projects of cooperation and exchange to find common ground uh, towards the the future so this is one main uh, area that we I believe can should con continue to contribute for a full reconciliation. Friends have been uh, raising the issue of helping families of uh, Saigon soldiers, uh, uh, finding the remains of these soldiers, I think, uh, would be a very humanitarian, humane thing to do. Perhaps it's not yet started yet, but we should look into that at the right moment uh, and in the right way. This would bring, bring closure to quite a number of families uh, in the South. <laughs>